All right, Shalom. Uh, first and foremost, I'd like to start out by giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. And Shalom to the elect out there pushing out this word in truth and in sincerity. This is the brother Yahweh Allah from GMS Chicago uh, coming back at you with another lesson. Um, and this is going to be a response to uh, the video done by, um, I believe his name is Elder Boaz. He goes by the name of, and it's the video he entitled, uh, My Take on the White Man Being the Devil, or something to that effect, right? But, um, yeah, man, you know, I was watching it, and, uh, you know, I was watching it, you know, all these scriptures were coming to mind, how this guy's going off, man. You know, he, his, his way, his, his thought process is all carnal, man. You know, he's, he's not making any sense, man. He's just trying to, uh, make mm -hmm. peace with everybody, man. You know, when this, when the scripture's not like that, man. All right. Uh, and then just off the bat, the name of his video says my take on it. Hey, well, your take doesn't matter, man. Your take doesn't matter. It's, it's what the scripture says. Okay. You know, this is, uh, the book of Sirach. Chapter 3, verse 24, it says, For many are deceived by their own vain opinion. And that's what it is, man. Your take don't matter, man. Okay? At the end of the day, it says, An evil suspicion has overthrown their judgment. Okay? You know, and, it's, it's, and it all goes back to, you know, trying to be friends with everybody, man. Love everybody, man. The, the scripture's not about that, man. The, the, the Lord separated the nations into uh uh you know different uh um uh, you know the separated the the people the the human people in, in into uh, different nations man so he has made a separation all right um and then because uh uh one of the things that uh this uh elder boaz was saying he was saying that um that if you think that uh <laughs> that the so-called white man's the devil then don't go uh, to his to his jobs, don't file taxes. And pretty much what he was saying was don't go to and, and uh, you know uh, um, ask or or, or 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 go for him of anything. All right, which that's completely against the scriptures, man. You know that just shows you that this man is just carnal, man. He does he doesn't go off what's what's the the real deal, man. You know that's just something silly to say, man. Oh, cause you, cause you gotta go to him for everything. That means that that he's not the devil. That's that's simple, man. Okay, and right here in uh, Deuteronomy chapter twenty-eight, that was one of the curses that we're supposed to do uh, go through. That this is uh, Deuteronomy chapter twenty-eight, verse forty-eight. It says, "Therefore shall thy serve thy enemies, which Yah which Yahweh shall send against thee in hunger and in thirst and in nakedness." And in want of all things, and he shall put a yoke of, of iron upon thy neck until he have destroyed thee. Okay, and that yoke of iron was put when uh, the so-called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans were in slavery. All right, but the point I brought it out was it says uh, in want of all things, and that's what we're doing now. We have to go to to this man system. If not, we can't eat. You know, the scripture says you don't work, you don't eat, you know, but it, it's set up that way. Even the scripture says, you know, it says you're going to go to your enemies. All right. So, yes, he is. He is the devil, man. He is, a, 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 you know, a, a, you know, our, our enemy, man. You know, and, and, and his uh, true nationality is Esau Edom, man, is that so-called white people. All right. And, and that's what it was, man. <laughs> Just because you go to him for a, one of all things doesn't mean that he's not the devil. And, and there's many scriptures that back that up, man. We got, we got over here in Daniels chapter 4, verse 17. It says, This matter is by the decree of the watchers, and that the man by the, ho the word of the holy ones, to the intent that the living may know that the Most High ruleth in the kingdom of men, and giveth it to whomsoever he will, and setteth up over it the bases of men. So that's what's going on. Right now, the Most High has set up the bases of all men. You know? But you want to say, oh, you know, oh, they're, uh, they're not all that bad. You know? <laughs> you know, hey, man, just because, uh, uh, you know, certain uh, who you who uh, the world ignorantly calls today are uh, white people, 
Just because uh, some of them help you out doesn't mean that they're not going to get their judgment, man. You know, doesn't mean that the Most High is dealing with them, man. And we're gonna get, we're gonna read that too, man. You know, let me get this right here. This is uh, Job nine and twenty four. It says, "The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered the faces of, of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he?" So the point is, is that uh, uh, um, the wicked are in authority, man. Okay. So the, the Lord is not dealing with these people, man. You know, you have a base man up on top. And we have our enemy here in one of all things, man. So uh, your reasoning is not according to scripture, man. Okay. I'm going to go to uh, the next one. And this, this is the point I wanted to bring about even if they're being nice to you, man, that don't mean nothing. This guy's talking about, oh, because he taught me how to build a house. From from uh um from the foundation on up, nah, he ain't the devil because he 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 taught me how to how to build a house. That doesn't make any sense, man. Okay, and then we have right here in Job twenty and ten, it says his children. Uh, um, you know what? Yeah, I'm gonna read ten. Get to, get to the point. Job twenty and ten. It says his children shall seek to please the poor. And his hands shall restore their goods. Okay? So that's what, that was prophecy that it was going to happen afterwards. Our enemy w was set up. We had that yoke of iron. You know? And we were going to go to him uh, uh, in one of all things. You know? So our enemy was set up. Uh, uh, Job 9.24 says the, the, the wicked are set up. You know? but And then Job uh, uh, 20 and 10 right here says that, that their children are going to want to uh, please the poor, man. You know, uh, uh, restore the, uh, their goods, man. So now, what do you have? You uh, uh, you know, 50 years ago, you had all these Edomites, so-called white people coming up against us, you know, uh, uh, hiding it not, having no shame in it. But now, it's like they have what they call that white guilt, man. So they're, they're, just, they're, they're uh, you know, trying to be nice to you, helping you out. But that doesn't change from the judgments that, that are going to come, man. Okay. It says, oh, it's, uh, uh, you know, because he helped me how to build a house, man. That's ridiculous, man. Okay. The scripture says that, that we're going to do that. Okay. You know, I, I, I'm going to go over here to Isaiah 14 because there's another point he made. He said that, um, that, that, that Satan or the devil was a spirit. Okay. Well, check this out. This is Isaiah 14 and 12. It says, how are thy fallen from heaven, O Lucifer? You know, that's who that's who you guys call the devil, right? Lucifer. You know, but which really Lucifer just means light bearer. Okay. Uh, it says, son of the morning. And, uh, and devil means deceiver. It says, son of the morning, how are thou cut down to the ground, which did is weaken the nations? Okay. Uh, it says, for thou hast said in thy heart, I will ascend into heaven. I will exalt my throne above the stars of Yahweh. I will sit also upon the mount of her congregation in the sides of the north. I will ascend above the heights of the clouds. I will be like the Most High. Yet thou shalt be brought down to hell to the sides of the pit. So this Lucifer here, you know, he's trying to exalt himself to be like the Most High, man. Hey, we just read the Job 9.24. The wicked that were, were set in authority, they covered the faces of the judges. Who made a, a so-called uh, uh, the, the image of God, uh, God and His Son as as as, as so-called white people? Well, they did it themselves. Okay, you know, and, and this says uh, they will sit above the clouds. They will be like the Most High. You know, well, this is they even put their you know, well, this right here is talking about their uh, you know uh, uh, their into uh, what's it called? Uh, I forgot, uh, the name is slipping, but, you know, the International Space Station, okay? You know, because they're trying to be out there. That's why I put all them, the, them satellites up there because they want to have that, uh, 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 you know, that uh, power like the Most High has, man, where he can, he has his eyes in all things, man, you know? That's why you have those strong-ass cameras up in the sky, man, because Esau Edom, the so-called white man, w w likes to play God, man. All right? And it's, it's really that simple. You know, as we keep reading, we're going to find out that that Lucifer is talking about 
uh, 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 the so-called white people, man. Verse 15, it says, Yet thou shalt be, uh, uh, you know, brought down to hell to the size of the pit. They shall, they that see thee shall narrowly look upon thee and consider thee, saying, Is this the man that made the earth to tremble, that did shake kingdoms? All right, so this Lucifer, hey, uh, uh, there is a, 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 a man counter, a, a man part. Um, how do you say it? A, a, a male uh, uh, equivalent. Of, of, of Satan, man, of, of the devil, man. All right, you know this Lucifer is a man who did his week in the nations, man. Who's in authority right now, man? So-called white people, man. They're, they're really Edomites, man. That's their real nationality. Okay. So, 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 what is this guy talking about, man? You know, he's just he's just trying to, you know, uh, get everybody together in a big group hug, man. When the scriptures not speaks nothing concerning that, man. All right, just because he, he taught you how to how to build a house, man. Shit, if, if, if we were, if we had if we weren't raped, robbed, and pillaged, uh, um, um, beforehand, we would have already known that, man. In our own societies, we knew how to build uh, certain certain uh, uh, structures, man. But now, because we're so low, we need them to actually teach us things, man. And go to them in one of all things, man. But now, because they're giving you the crumbs. You know, something that you should have already known. Oh, now, you, now you're grateful, man. Nah, man. We, we, fell, we fell away greatly. All right? From, from, from the conquest of these devils, man. All right? And that's the point, man. It also shows, you know, he doesn't know. Because he's talking about, uh, 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 you know, um, the devil is a spirit. Which, there is a, a spiritual part, a uh, 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 counterpart uh, 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 of Satan. You know, which he's under the control of the Most High, you know, uh, you know, and um, you have a, a a man part of, of of the devil as well, man, which is this Edomite, man. Okay, and it's clear as that, you know, and that's just the way it is, man. You know, and um, at the end of the day, man, that that's what it boils down to. It boils down to him wanting to be hand in hand with the devil, man. You know, trying to seek love, man, when not, love was never shown. All right. This is uh, Proverbs chapter 11, verse 21. It says, though hand join in hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished, but the seed of the, of the righteous shall be delivered. And that's a seed. That's a whole bloodline right there, man. This guy is talking about that it's not about race, man. All right. The seed of the righteous are going to be delivered, man. But even though... You have certain Israelites, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans holding hand in hand with this devil, this Edomite. That doesn't mean that they're not going to go unpunished, man. Just because they, they taught you how to put up some nails, man. Jake is bugged the hell out, man. That doesn't matter. You know? Finish off with these last two scriptures. This is uh, the book of Jer Jeremiah. Chapter 2. Verse 33, it says, Why trimmest thou thy ways to seek love? Therefore how thou, therefore has thou also taught the wicked ones thy ways, man. And th this guy, man, Elder Boaz, he's going out, out of his, his own way of thinking, his own vain opinion, trying to seek love, man. Oh, God loves everybody. As long as, you know, you, you help me, <laughs> you help me out to build a house. You know, you help me do something, man. That that, that doesn't have uh, that's not a wise saying, man. It's what the scripture says, man. Okay. It says I'm gonna read it again. Uh, Jeremiah two and two thirty three. Why trimmest thou thy ways to seek love? Therefore, how has thou also taught the wicked ones thy ways? And that's what you're doing, man. You had all these people in the comment board. Oh yeah, you know, keep preaching, man. Hey, hey, all those people on the comment board, they're going to get judged too, man. For trying to seek love, man, when there was no love, man. All right? The earth is given unto the hand of the wicked. That's who's ruling. Okay? But, hey, man, even though you, you, you want to join hand in hand with them, that doesn't mean they're going to be saved. That just means you're going to stick with them and catch the judgment with them, man. As the scripture says here in Isaiah 13. Is Isaiah 13 and 
and 15. It says, Every one that is found shall be thrust through, and every one that is joined unto them shall fall by the sword, man. And that's what you're doing, man. Hey, man, you keep keep building those houses with those Edomites, man. You know? <laughs> hey, at the end of the day, you're going to get that judgment staying with them, man. All right? That's what the scriptures says right here, man. You know? If you join unto them, you shall fall by the sword, man. So, hey, right now is a time, is a time of separation, man. You know? Esau, Edom, he's been living in, in this world wickedly for the longest, man. And the Most High is getting getting time to come back to, to give him his judgment, man. He who destroyed the earth, man. All right? I'm going to end it off with that, one, that scripture. His revelations. Revelations chapter 11, verse 18. And the nations were angry. And that's what's happening now, man. All, all around the world, you have the nations. They're being angry, man. And, and mainly they're being angry at America, man. Uh, 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 you know, uh, you know, they're looking at at America crazy right now. It says, um, "And the nations were angry, and thy wrath is come, and the time, and the time of the dead that the, it shall be judged, and that thou shouldest give reward unto thy servants, the prophets." So the prophets are, are in for a reward, all right? And to the saints and them that fear thy name, small and great. And should it destroy them, which destroy the earth. And that's the point, man. Esau, Edom, he's been destroying the earth. He's been destroying the people of the Most High. He's been destroying everything, you know. And just because you want you want to hold his hand and give him a, a, a big old hug, doesn't mean that he's not going to get judged, man. The, uh, the people were always judged as a nation. You know, you we had righteous kings, uh, uh, um, you know, uh, like it, it's written in Jeremiah. It says, uh, you know, thee even thyself and thy king shall go into captivity, man. Let me see, if, you know, let me get that real quick. I don't want to chop it up. This is Jeremiah 17 and 4. And thou even thyself shall discontinue from thy heritage that I gave thee. Oh, no, no, I'm thinking about it in Deuteronomy 28. So lock you. Because uh, it says, thee and thy king. That was one of the curses, man. Um. Uh, let see if I'll find it real quick. <clears throat> it says, Thou and thy king, they shall go into captivity, man. You know? So, you know, you, you, you even had a, 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 you know, a righteous people that, 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 um, that went into that captivity, man. You know? So, 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 these people out here, man, they're, they're all going to get judged, man, as a nation. You know? Let me see. Come, you know, that's the point, that's the point, man, Esau, Edom, you can't hide from your judgment, and even though you got uh, uh, certain Israelites, so-called blacks, Latinos, Native Americans, that they, they want to be cool with you, and you cool with them, you know, that, that still doesn't change the mind of the Most High, man, he's still coming back for that judgment, man, all right, so uh, with that, I hope the elect out there was edified. You know, I want to end by giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, the monarchs, the apostles of Great Millstone, ruler, teach well. And Shalom to the elect out there, pushing out this word in truth and in sincerity. Uh, with that, Shalom and a Baba Ball.